Hey, what up guys? I thought I'd shoot you a quick video to help you with some of these research notes. Research notes, incredibly important to, to get in all the relics you need, especially if you are trying to kit out an entire army like me with the Keem and Fractal relics, you might need just a little bit of help and also for your end of dragon legendaries so here's how to get some research notes really quickly now this method will require you to have played the game a little bit and basically have crazy amounts of stockpiles what we do is we use a research kit and we can deconstruct anything that is crafted so if you get any of these hero choice boxes ascended gear boxes from radian fractals things like that especially if you're like me you're basically too full of them so much so that your bank is just overflowing in the old times, I used to just throw these things away because you can't give them to anyone. They just clog up your space. And I was too lazy to deconstruct them and craft things. So by using these, we can just select some random box. And after selecting our random box, we will end up with a piece of armor. Now we can't deconstruct this because this was not crafted, but there is a little step here that you can do. Now bear in mind, you can do this for all sorts of things. You can do it for weapons and for armor pieces. So very important to just be aware of that. Now we go over to the trading post. We open up the trading post and we go to crafting materials and we search for insignia. Trying to spell and make a video. Terrible stuff. Then what we're going to go is we're just going to go something like level lady and we're searching for exotic rarity and we want to sort by price. And this will basically give us the cheapest insignia. This is obviously shamans. So we're going to buy one of these bad boys and learn how to close the auction house at the same time. There we go. We got that. Head over to the Mystic Forge. And what we're going to do is we're going to have a chat to this lovely lady and get ourselves an anthology of heroes. This is 10 spirit shards. Now what we do is we go over to the Mystic Forge itself and we're going to throw this in. Ignore my terrible management of inventory it is it is what it is what is this i could have done this to this and what we're going to do now is we're going to take the armor piece that we have the cheap insignia or inscription depending on if it's a piece of armor or weapon we're going to throw our anthology of heroes and our globs of ectoplasm this is the most expensive obviously of the process close to a gold somewhere on there now we get ourselves a piece of armor now this piece of armor we can deconstruct and this will give us an absolute ton of research notes. And that's what we're after. That amount of research notes is basically going to help us be able to afford all those fancy inscriptions. So if we look there, obviously, I got a train load for this one. Um, in my experience, I found that one handed and two handed weapons give the same. So basically, just if you have anything that you're not using, like you don't have weapons or pieces of armor just lying around, all you do, switch the stats back to something that's base game, so shamans, you know, something like that, something very cheap, and then just deconstruct it with your research kit, and there you go. Tons of research notes, and now I can carry on gearing all of my army of tunes. Have a good one, guys. Cheers.